Despite the fact that Samsung and Google launched the Google Samsung Galaxy Nexus, many still believe that the Samsung Galaxy S2 is still the Android phone of the moment. Now we won't go into that debate, but Samsung has promised an official ice cream sandwich ROM update for the Samsung Galaxy S2 and we're expecting it to be roll rolled out sometime this quarter. That being said, we have a leaked official but not final version of the ice cream sandwich ROM. It is of January 29 and we'll take a look at how it runs on the phone and it should give us a slight idea on what to expect in terms of software for the Samsung Galaxy S2. This is Anton Dinoid from PocketNow.com. Let's take a look at ice cream sandwich on the Samsung Galaxy S2. Now straight from the beginning you'll notice that the unlocking mechanism has changed. You no longer have to swipe off the entire lock screen wallpaper, but once you put your finger on the screen, regardless of its position, you will be presented with the unlock ring, which is typical to ice cream sandwich. But of course we have seen the ring in the past with HTC devices and with HTC Sense, but this is more ice cream sandwich like. Now once you put your finger on the screen, you will be presented with a small lock and once you move your finger towards the edges of the screen that lock will be opening up gradually until you manage to unlock your phone. And this is the home screen of the Samsung Galaxy S2. It's running Android 4.0.3 Ice Cream Sandwich with, with Samsung's own TouchWiz user interface on top of it. And the TouchWiz user interface has been slightly modified. Now we have the still this we have the still the same numbers of uh, home screens and you can swipe between them but you can see that swiping and flipping through the home screens is more fluid. One of the changes Samsung has included with the new touch with user interface is that when you reach the end and you still try to swipe you will be presented with this little animation basically a uh, tilting of the plane to let you know that there's nowhere else to swipe to and this is valid when you reach the other end as you can see the plane tilting and also in the applications once you are at the last page you can swipe no more so this is one of the new additions in the ice cream sandwich ROM for the Samsung Galaxy S2 another new feature of course is the notification drawer it still looks the same but because of ice cream sandwich all the notifications which you will get here will be swipeable that means that if you have a new email, text message, call, tweet, whatever, you'll be able to swipe it off and basically clear your notifications from this area. In addition, you'll have you'll still have the clear button which will be placed right here. Now, in terms of applications, there are not many new applications. You will notice that Google Plus and Google Plus Messenger are installed by default so expect to see them once Samsung rolls out the new ice cream sandwich ROM. That aside, once we get back to TouchWiz and talk about widgets, Samsung didn't add, at least not in this version of the ROM, any new widgets so whatever you will find down here matches what you currently have on your gingerbread powered Galaxy S2. Now diving into settings you will see the new ice cream sandwich settings with what's important at the top wireless and networks of course you have the more button and as you can see the scrolling is fluid you can notice the new Roboto font which is standard for ice cream sandwich and while we are here let's take a look at the version numbers as you can see it's currently 4.0.3 this is not the official final version it's an official version but it has been leaked but still it's pretty close to final we find it to be stable we find it to be fast so we wouldn't be surprised if we would see an official rollout coming soon let's take a look at the camera application which is still basically the same as you've seen before you have your menu right here with the the new menus which come with ice cream sandwich that aside everything is unchanged. Now let's take a look at the internet browser because this has been pretty much improved in Ice Cream Sandwich. 
we have pocketnow.com loaded but we will also load a sub page just to see how fast it is so far scrolling is very smooth and you won't be able to see any checkerboard in the browser if you double tap to zoom in it will be as fluid as possible even more fluid than it was on gingerbread and uh, again it's not choppy it's just buttery smooth and let's get back here now let's go home on a web page and see how fast it loads it should take a couple of seconds we have all add-ons enabled we have flash enabled and we should consider that when we take a look at the browser speed you can easily scroll the page while it is loading it will have no problem with that it manages just fine let's see how screen rotation is it's not instant but it's nice ice cream sandwich brings that Windows Phone 7 like animation when you tilt the phone which is now common to many platforms iOS also does that so instead of just presenting you with the new view you will be presented with a small animation rotation but that also adds to the rotation time that aside rotation is quick browsing is quick zooming panning is also quick and the new Roboto font is very 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 readable on this device let's take a look at the gallery application which is also slightly improved but the general looks and concept are the same you will be finding it to behave a little bit more smooth than on gingerbread for instance but um, the basic gallery is still just the same of course talking about the pictures Samsung also included its uh, picture editing application which should be right here right here it's photo editor it's useful if you want to quickly edit pictures on your phone now we don't want this to be a software review we are just taking a look at ice cream sandwich on the Samsung Galaxy S2 this is what you should expect slightly improved performance buttery smooth scrolling overall a good addition to a great phone this was Anton D. Knight from pocketnow.com taking a quick look at the ice cream sandwich leaked ROM for the Samsung Galaxy S2 if you've enjoyed this video please give us a thumbs up thanks for watching